Hello everybody, welcome back in our training center. My name is Dmitry, I'm an ATPL student. And today I will show you the basics of VR approach using Flight and Navigation Procedure Trainer FNPT2. So, what is it VR approach? Comparing to ILS, VR system is less precise and doesn't have glass slope indications. During VR approach, the only indications you need it is your final radio from VR and distance from DME. And now I will show you how to perform an approach correctly by using chart. Today we will be performing VR approach in Kaunas International Airport runway 08 using AIP chart. Before every flight you have to carefully study your chart and be familiar with all procedures. Make sure that you use the latest version of the chart. Let's review it. There is VR approach chart of Kaunas International Airport runway 08. The all information we need we can see there. Our frequencies, view from the above, missed approach procedures, etc. According to our chart, we have to fly 3000 feet over our VR DME, Kilo November Alpha, then descend to 2200 feet, following radial 293 from Kilo November Alpha till distance 9.1. Then turn left to intercept final radial, fly 2200 till distance 6 nautical miles from touchdown, and only then start descending by monitoring distance and altitude. Don't forget that your system is less precise, so you will be aiming directly to your beacon. In our case, it is a little bit right of the runway. Also, you need to be familiar with missed approach procedures. If something happens during your landing, probably you won't have time to read the chart. We are in a cockpit of our FNPT training, preparing for takeoff. Selecting uh, our frequencies of our VR approach, uh, checking takeoff course, uh, selecting flaps, takeoff, landing lights, taxi lights. Uh, Selecting our Q and H. If everything OK, uh, let's take off. Lima Yankee Bravo Alpha Kilo ready for departure runway 08. Lima Yankee Bravo Alpha Kilo take off, 2200 feet, down sun right 3000 feet to kilo November Alpha. Taking off 2200 feet, then turn right 3000 to kilo November Alpha. Lima Yankee Bravo Alpha Kilo. So let's take off. Full throttle. Try to keep you on the center line. Speed 60, start pulling. Continue climbing. Altitude 800, retract flaps. Switch off landing lights. Continue climbing 2200. We are almost on 2200 feet, let's turn right, uh, continue climbing 3000 feet toward Kilo November Alpha. Select your altitude and continue climbing. Three thousand feet, level off. Reduce your pain. Let's request our VR approach. Lima Yankee Bravo Alpha Kilo request VR approach runway 08. 
Clear to your approach runway 08, passing kilo November Alpha, uh, will report when uh, established. Lima Yankee Bravo Alpha kilo. One mile from Kilo November Alpha. Let's put our radial two nine three. Pass our Kilonob Alpha, let's intercept our radio. While we flying on radio, we have some time. Uh, let's read the approach check. Let's read Mr. Approach Procedures, climb your Kilonova Alpha, then turn on uh, radial 088 to 3000 feet. Radar vector will be provided. In case of radio communication failure, climb to Kilonova Alpha, then uh, on radial 088 to reach 2200 at uh, 9 nautical miles from Kilonova Alpha, then turn right to Kilonova Alpha, climb to 3000. Uh, our frequencies of our UR approach is set. Radio com frequency set. So now let's descend to 2200, put it on altitude, reduce RPM. We are almost on our altitude. Uh, select correct RPM and only then level off. We are almost nine miles. Then now I will turn left to intercept our final radio. Also, we have to take into account that this chart was made for airplanes that much faster than our Cessna. That's why our procedures will be a little bit different. I will fly perpendicular to localizer course till our control radial 272. And then I will turn to 45 degrees to our to intercept our localizer course. We are almost on uh, control radial 272. I will uh, turn to intercept our final course. We are on final radial. Uh, before ending checklist, check for the speed. Landing light on, flaps 10. Uh, now I can report to ATC. Lima Yankee Bravo Alpha Kilo on final radial, ready to land.
Lima alpha kilo cleared to land run with rate. Start descending from six mile from touchdown, according to our chart. So six miles start descending. Now we working using our chart uh, on five miles we have to be at altitude uh, 1880 at four miles we have to be at altitude 1560 also put your go around altitude 3000 feet our minimum 760. Four miles, altitude 1560. Continue descending. On altitude three miles, we have to be on altitude 1240. miles altitude correct on two miles we have to be on altitude 920 approaching our minimum minimum runway inside continue visually Monitoring your speed. Let's align ourselves. Reducing your RPM and land. Flare a little bit. Nose up. Locating left, stand number five. Lema Yanki Bravo Alpha Kilo. There was the basics of your approach. I hope it was useful for you. Thank you for watching. That's all for today. See you in our next videos.